equal halves part 3 today we will learn things can be divided into half in a number of ways hello madam hello vandana and aishman today i have got chocolates for both of you here you go thank you madam and for me i have got only one chocolate for both of you you both divide this chocolate into half okay madam thank you i will divide this chocolate into half in how many ways can you divide this chocolate into halves this chocolate has six pieces this is one way i can divide it into two equal parts i will break this from the middle like this there will be two equal parts is there any other way to divide this chocolate in half look vandana we can divide this into two equal parts like this by using this way to divide in two parts we still have three pieces each i did not think that we can divide into two equal parts using this way then it can also be divided into two equal parts like this absolutely right vandana this means that the same thing can be divided into halves in many ways yes look at this paper it is a rectangular paper and it can also be cut into halves in many ways you also try to divide it into halves in many ways this paper can be divided into equal halves in this way you have divided it into two halves in quite a few ways yet there are many more ways by which it can be divided into halves what are the other ways by which it can be divided into halves look this is also another way oh yes this can be divided into half like this too we didn't think of this similarly there are more ways in which they can be divided into half i have understood this means the paper is measured based on its area so we can divide it into half in any way we just have to take care that the two parts are of the same area absolutely right vandana today you learned there can be several ways to divide objects into halves depending on its area like vandana and ayushman divided the paper into two halves in different ways Thank <music> you.